Hello comrades, Commissar Bro here today with some superpower 2, yes actually superpower 2, yeah, finally you guys wore me down after messaging and commenting me every single day for like 7 years you finally wore me down. <laughs> Just kidding, we're not actually going to play it today, but we are going to talk about superpower. Ha ha! I baited you. Oh man, I'm a horrible person. <laughs> but no, 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 in all, in all seriousness, we're going to talk about uh, Superpower 3. I, I said a couple months ago when they first announced Superpower 3 that I was going to do some kind of video regarding it and talk about it a little bit, and I never got around to it. So uh, here here we are. Here we are today. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about Superpower 3, my thoughts on it, and if we will actually see any Superpower 3 on the channel. Yeah, I, I bet you guys are excited. So first and foremost, let's set the stage. Let me tell you guys more about me, because I feel like there's a little disconnect between who old Commissar Bro is today as opposed to who he was, what, eight years ago? It's been a, been a little bit of time. Like, things have changed, you know, people change. Uh, so you guys can understand why it's it's a lot harder for me to make YouTube videos than it used to be. I, I work in an IT job, and I work in the actual IT industry, and, you know, that's my main job, my, my 40 to 50 hours a week, depending on the week. I also coach eSports for high school and college level teams and different cities. So that takes up a lot of my time. And then on top of that, I, I moonlight, I guess you could say as a voice actor, I do my voice acting bits. If you follow the channel for a while, I've been in a, a couple of Warhammer games doing orcs, space marines, all sorts of stuff. And that's pretty much still the same thing. I'm actually in a game right now, which I believe I could talk about since they've released the demo for it and they showed it. You know, the I actually play as... Uh, the main villain in that game and a bunch of other characters but again I'm not exactly sure what I'm allowed to talk about so you can go play the demo and you can see me in it uh, so and yeah that, that's that's something I'm gonna be in. I was actually gonna be in a couple of other uh, newer games but realistically speaking I'm, I'm so busy with all my other jobs that it's it's kind of difficult to fit all this stuff together so Coming back to the, my YouTube channel and, and why the content is so dry, that that's why. You know, I, I own my own house and I have to pay my bills and stuff like that. You know, and again, this isn't an excuse, but I'm an adult and it's it's just harder than it used to be. Uh, when when I was a little bit younger, I was going, I was in college, uh, so I was broke, so I couldn't afford any of the cool stuff to be able to do cooler stuff, but uh, now I have money to where I could afford to do cooler stuff. I can buy games more frequently and such like that, but I never have time to do the videos. So, I <laughs> guess that's how it works, huh? Of course, there's always that, uh, like, well, why don't you stay home and stream and blah, blah, blah. And it's like, well, I would love to, but that's uh, not really viable, I think, in my particular case now, anyway, to try to build up that user base i if i could i would i would absolutely love to do like twitch or youtube and stuff like that and my voice acting on the side and potentially just my esports coaching so if i could if i could quit my main job and do these things that i love i absolutely would not that i don't enjoy it it's it's all right it's not bad um but i would much prefer doing voice acting full-time or youtube full-time or twitch full-time but I digress. Now that you guys know a little bit more about me and why content is kind of dry, I do want to do more. Like this has been something I've done for so long and I constantly have like dreams and aspirations to come back and, and do more things. Superpower 3 will be one of them in this particular case. I will do at least a couple videos of superpower three when it comes out that that is no joke and honestly if anything is kind of a last hurrah um i'm probably going to do a rise of Djibouti of superpower three it's it's going to happen very likely um and i i can't guarantee it's going to be as good or uh, it, you guys are going to like it as much as you liked it then I'm gonna try, <laughs> but my sense of humor is super different than it used to be. Um, but just like, hopefully, 
you guys will ultimately end up liking it should the game release and I actually get a chance to do it. Because you know, I could always die before Super Power 3 comes out because let's be real, they originally teased that they were going to do it back in like 2006 or 2007, right? They said they, said they were going to do it back then. But then they didn't officially, and then they said 2015, they, they, they got the website, and they, they, they did all that, and then, and then it's 2022, and they finally announced the game, but we don't, we still don't have a release date. What is this, Golem Labs? But anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna do some kind of Superpower 3 whenever the game comes out. Uh, so, what are some of the features that I'm excited about? Well, I'm gonna be real with you. I've kind of, I've kind of seen the character creator. I've read the dev diary regarding the character creator for Super Power Three, and I think it's uh, okay. I suppose without seeing exactly how it's going to affect the game right now, I don't really know how to feel about it. But actually, looking at a bunch of the screenshots they've shown thus far of the game, I'm excited because it looks like they're keeping the core of what I like about Super Power Two. You know, the sliders the budget management, um, and they've given these nice, nice looking, very pretty looking graphics of the actual world, of the nukes and stuff like that. So I'm I'm feeling pretty good overall. And and realistically speaking, Super Power 2 is such a, a such an easy, fun game to get into. It's this fine line of relatively easy to pick up. It's a pretty decent amount of modding that goes into it. You don't have to be a geopolitical genius to play this game or a logistics genius to play this game again as long as you pretty much have a strong budget and you can build a big military you can take over the world it's a simple game it's easy for people to pick up i like that so i'm hoping that superpower 3 well of course expanding more depth to the game doesn't stray too far from the overall simplicity that superpower 2 has i would like if they would show more screenshots on the military aspect of things more i want more I, I i want i want like some actual gameplay footage or something uh because you know again i have been waiting for this game for a really really long time mm, kisses boys you're doing good work i i, I try to act uh, nonchalant about it but really I am excited about it you know this game was a big part of my life and even just the the impact that my YouTube channel and superpower had on my YouTube channel and how my YouTube channel ultimately affected my later life like today it's it's had a big impact so I feel like I would be doing a disservice to not play superpower 3 uh, for my community whether you guys even like me or not anymore or not which honestly i don't blame you if you don't I'm kind of an asshole but that's okay a lot of you guys are too <laughs> so anyway this has been commissar bro love you guys and uh can't wait to see you in the future with some superpower three so yeah i'll catch y'all later